hello everyone so today i am going to discuss you about how we are going to enroll for technical courses uh, from coursera site so as we are very keen nowadays we are at the pandemic situation we are very keen to study uh, new new courses so one of the site which we are delivering which we are giving the online facility is coursera site coursera site is giving us new new courses so first i am going to show you if you are joining as a free member so how many charge they are charging for you for a particular course and the same thing if you are going through any organization any three com campus nowadays the campus uh, their coursera is uh, giving the facility to the campus to for upgrading their skills for as a free membership so i am going to show you the two bifurcation if you are joining as a free member so how much charge they are taking for example i am going, going to coursera site and now for joining they are asking me full name email and password so as i have already uh, used my email id so i am going to show you for example as a free member for uh, any particular course how much they are charging and why you while you are going through campus sponsorship so you are giving the same particular course as a free so i am showing you if i am going through as a free member so how much they are charging to me i am using my full name then i am using my email id then i will show you how to explore the different different courses through this site how to select a particular course so i have uh, done my login so this after login you are able to see your name and this is particular home page of the coursera site so skip this side now how to explore so if you are going to see this explore you are able to see the different different section computer science data science information technology math and logic personal development physical science and engineering for example for engineering background i am uh, taking this special video so for physical and engineering i am going to select this exploring this physical science and engineering so under this physical science and engineering you are able to see the different different types of course now for example i am uh, talking about a particular course building arduino robots and devices if i am selecting this particular course so for particular this uh, course i am if i am enrolling as a free membership without any having a sponsorship from any organization any campus so if i am going for enrolling for free so please pay, see here how much they are charging for particular complete course with certificate purchase course 2189 of this particular course charges they are taking with complete certificate so this is the difference while we are going as a normal uh, student without any support of any organization without any support of any organization sponsorship so this particular single course they are asking 2189 rupees for getting a e certificate of course for doing any course there is uh, nothing worth without having any e certificate we are uh, have wants some proof also that we have done that particular course so that's why e certificate is very very important for us to represent us that we have done this particular course so this is the difference once uh, i want to clear with you if you are going as a normal free member without having a sponsorship of any organization so this particular course they are asking us to pay rupees 2189 rupees for getting e certificate now i am log out from this and i am going to now i have log out from the join as a free student free member student now i am going to give you one example if i am having access through any organization sponsorship so the same thing i am getting the same thing i am getting as a free so for example i am working in anjuman islam kalsega technical campus so under this organization they have uh, given the authority for sponsorship to their students for uh, getting the course as a free sponsorship so what we have to do in anjuman islam kalsega technical campus there, there must be a, any uh, admin 
so we have to give them our email id and they will provide us the access of sponsorship of coursera site so i have uh, mailed to the admin of anjuman islam classical technical campus now that admin has approved me and uh, delivered me the mail through which i am going to get free sponsorship of this particular coursera site now for example this i am showing you the email inbox the email from that uh, particular anjuman islam classical technical campus admin of coursera site now this email i am going to click on this start learning now so after start learning now now please pay attention this anjuman islam classical technical campus site start learning join for free so please click on this join for free now what they are asking this is my email through which i have registered now i have to set any password some password so i am going to set my password after the putting my password click on continue so once you log in with your uh, sponsorship email id so it will ask for you to resend confirmation email so you have to click on resend confirmation email and go to your email inbox and please check please check this ask for your confirmation of your email that coursera site will ask for confirm email address of your particular sponsor email id so confirm or that confirm email address so it will show you your email address is verified thank you okay now back to coursera site back to coursera again you are invited to join the program join program join program now you are able to see explore it same particular course we are able to get as a free sponsorship now we are under that particular section i am selecting the same particular course now same particular course is having a sponsorship by anjuman islam classical technical campus now i am going to same particular course building arduino robots and devices which i have shown you earlier which was asking to, for me 2189 rupees now if i am going to enroll for free now if i am enroll for free this particular is now is particular enroll without asking any money now he, it is asking for me to go to course so i am going to course so the whole course will be unable to me and it is also asking your computer time zone does not seem to match your coursera account time zone change your coursera time zone setting so please select this time zone setting it is showing here los angeles so please select your site for example if i am residing living in india so in indian standard time is followed as kolkata kolkata standard timing so you have to go for kolkata select it kolkata english and save so updated successfully so updated successfully it is also asking add your personal account here save your reset uh, different different things are asking to you and the same thing verify your real name to make sure you receive a e certificate when you complete a course of specialization verify my name so verify my name so verify my name your what name you want to get in your certificate after completing this course so please write your name particular first name middle name last name and then submit then after completing that particular course this particular course you will receive your e certificate in by this name once you verify your name so this is how actually work now i am going to back to my course my coursera my courses if i am going to see my courses i am able to see the course which i have enrolled building arduino robots this is in my course welcome back if this is in my course go to course then it is going to start in detail 
week one, week two. So whatever the week wise, uh, this is course. So you have to go schedule wise course. And the main thing is that you after weekly schedule of videos watching videos, they are asking to appear for quiz. So in this particular course, uh, quiz, you have to give that particular quiz and they are asking uh, of minimum particular sum weightage percentage. For example, to go for further, you have to minimum score 80 percentage of marks in that particular quiz. And they are allowing you only three items each every after eight hours. For example, if you attempted first time not able to uh, score 80 percent, then you have to appear the same test after eight hours. They are allow you to give the same test after eight hours. In this way, you are allowed to appear for three items for passing that particular assignment, particular quiz. So this is the way we are able to get a sponsorship. This is the benefit of any having a sponsorship. So thank you very much for watching this video. Please comment your likes and share yours, whatever you like in this particular video, if you have getting benefits.